I'm telling you, Uchu, I have never heard of anyone getting bitten by a piranha on land before. It was a very angry fish. <laughs> I bet. Hey, Lara, come and join us. What are you two up to? Uchu and I are swapping scar stories. Jonah tells me you have a few yourself. <laughs> no great tales with mine, just me being callous. I got this one here from my cousin, Eli. Your cousin gave you that? And are you still speaking? Uh, <laughs> well, it wasn't my cousin exactly. It, uh, it was a worm that I... Perhaps I had to have been there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. So what about you? That one looks like it's got a good story to go with it. What happened? A very ancient recipe. <laughs> if my recipes did that, I think I'd rather starve. <laughs> it is not that kind of recipe. This one was for a weapon. Ah, what sort of weapon? The White Breath. It is a poison found deep in the wilderness. Its effects would double our numbers without adding a single life. Just the thing the Rebellion needs to push back Amaru and his army. So what happened? I failed. You couldn't find it? No, my friend. I was not worthy. To master the recipe of the White Breath, you must traverse the path of fear. It is a treacherous place filled with terrible demons. You believe the White Breath could save rebel lives? Many, but that hope is lost now. I cannot go back. It is too dangerous. What if I went with you? We could get the recipe for the White Breath together. I appreciate your offer, Lara, but the path of fear must be taken alone. Then I'll go. I cannot ask you to do that. You didn't. I'm offering. No. Lara, maybe this isn't something Uchu. you should... I can help. Please, let me. Take the passage through the water beneath this cave. It will lead you to the wilderness. From there, you're on your own. Thank <laughs> you. 
This can't be the path of fear. I must have... Hello? Can you hear me? Why don't you be happy with what you have? Mom!
can't breathe down here. Don't let this happen to me, Laura. Jonah! Jonah! Don't let this happen to me, Laura. Jonah! Good God. Laura! Laura! Why did you bring me here, Lara? Why would you do this to me? I've got you, Jonah. Please, please, hang on. Come on, don't be dead, please. Jonah, come on! Come on, Jonah! You know what to do. Go on. Do it! Whoa, what? Whoa, whoa, what? The pain. End it! I'm not in pain. Selfish brat! Their pain, not yours! All the lives you've destroyed, and so many more to come! You destroy everyone you touch! Little cancer! Little death! No, I, I, I wouldn't. They're, they're my friends. They're all... Dead or doomed. You know it. Feel it. You're a black thumb, Lara. Incapable of keeping life. First your mother, then your father, and now your friends! No! Hey, it's me, it's Jonah. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Oh, thank God. She made it. She's okay. Well done, Lara. You've proven yourself worthy. Now you must enter the Valley of the Monkey Gods and retrieve the White Breath. The Monkey Gods? You you mean the twins, Huna Han and Hoon Chevin? Yes. It is believed they authored the recipe for the White Breath as a means of revenge against the brothers who transformed them. Hunahan and Hunchevan must have traveled through here when they were banished from Paititi. No one's been through here in centuries. Valley of the Monkey Gods. It's a massive fault line. It must have fractured centuries ago. A perfect place to hide if you wanted to disappear like the Monkey Twins did. This place is falling apart, being exposed on the cliff sides like this. I'm amazed any of it's still here. It shows a procession of people coming to the Valley of the Gods, following sounds or song. They're all carrying their belongings and what looks like votive offerings. They must be worshippers. The monkey twins weren't ridiculed by everyone after fleeing Paititi. They were venerated by some.
Hunahan and Hunchevin. Those statues are enormous. This has to be a gate to something. This looks like a wooden turban. It seems to be jammed. What does this turban power, I wonder? There's no way forward. These are the blueprints for the instrument. The detail in the planning was extraordinary. Using the valley wind to power some sort of instrument.
Welcome back. Hey, you okay? I'm fine. She found it. Here, the white breath. Strange. Such a small thing can hold such great power. I hope it gives the Rebellion the advantage it needs over Amaru and his cult. I think we both know that it will. Uchu, I still think you owe us a story. Because I'm trying to put that scar and a recipe in the same equation. I don't really think there's anything to tell. <laughs> <laughs>